So here we are on the third down. The previous third down was the last play we reviewed. It was the completion from Tua to Gazicki for this first down. So on this third down, Gailey completely break, uh, breaks on uh, traditional play calling for him so far and runs a draw play. A draw is designed to show pass uh, routes to the defense to make them think we're passing the ball um, and then we actually run it. Uh, just a couple of things we'll look at when we look at Coulter's film is the difference between how Parker and Ford run the routes, the difference between staying on the team and getting cut, and also how Gazicki, the defence respect Gazicki and they're influenced by his route. So rather than show you uh, the defence starting position, they actually run a blitz on this third down. They just want to stop us from scoring. They're trying to keep everything in front of them. It's a cover one defence. Um, I've marked up who's responsible for who, with the question mark being um, the safety, um, actually marked with the question mark, how are we going to block him? In the end, we do a really good job of picking him up, um, and that's solely down to open field blocking from the offensive line, which we will look at. Normally, we'd look at both the offensive and defensive blocking schemes uh, in this situation, but the defense have run quite a complicated stunt on the left-hand side, involving a twist, a, D, a linebacker blitz, and a DB blitz. Um, and to draw in the blocking scheme would be quite complicated. So we'll look at it a little bit more in film, the scheme in some detail. Um, I know Gailey took a lot of stick over the course of the year um, for some very average play calling and some very average scheming. But this is a well-designed play. It works well. Uh, everyone does their job, with the exception of uh, Ford, I believe. Um, and we get what we deserve, which is a touchdown. It's also worth saying that the defence gamble, and we catch the defence in the worst look for them and the best look for us, but we'll look at that as well. So first thing I want to look at is the difference between staying on an NFL team, in my opinion, and the difference being cut. So at the bottom of the screen, we've got Parker, and at the top of the screen, we've got Ford. Um, this DB, worth saying, is a little bit more afraid of Parker um, and wants to attack him aggressively. This DB is looking in field, suggesting that it's zone and the DBs play it differently. However, the route is still the same. They're both showing that they're going to get the ball quickly as an outside receiver screen. Now, look, the, uh, Parker and Ford have both hooked up. This DB now is trying to press Parker and takes himself out of the play. You can already see now that Ahmed's running the ball and this DB is more afraid of Parker and takes himself out of the play. At the top of the screen, Ford has just taken this play off. I don't know if he knows he's going to be cut, he's not coming back, but this is his blocking responsibility. Get over there, block him. Um, so, and it's worth saying that for the duration of the play, although this is lazy from both players, Parker's, it doesn't matter how lazy it is, Parker's got blocking position on this DB and he's out of the play. So good job, Parker. Ford, tata son. Um, just we'll take it back now and look at Gazicki. Gazicki doesn't block anyone, but what he does is he influences two defenders from attacking the play. Right now we've got 59 who's uh, like Gazicki is playing this perfectly. He's running the route like he's going to get the football. Great. Linebacker's afraid of him. Um, this uh, DB, although he should be covering this receiver, is also afraid of Gazicki, and just for a second he holds them both. So we've got one, two, three defenders on that side of the field. But uh, Gazicki should be blocking, maybe, but uh, only against two blockers because Ford's taking this playoff. Now let's just go back to the very start. Um, what we're worried about here, as we mentioned, is this safety linebacker drops back and is actually the only one who we can't account for. But we two, th one, two things are going to happen. We're going to get good open field blocking from the guard and the tackle, who are Jackson and Flowers. As we roll it through, Jackson has the toughest job because he has to sell a pass the whole way. Then he sells it, pushes the defender off. Now this defender has to, is behind Ahmed. He has to pursue the whole way. So even if we don't get a touchdown here, he's on it. Ahmed, uh, tackle for Ahmed is going to result on a positive gain for us. However, Flowers is now in the open. This linebacker defensive end realizes the danger and collapses the pile, takes himself out of the play. Flowers blocks him. Good re read from Ahmed. Pancake. Brilliant. Love it. Love a pancake. However, now 
Jackson is in the open field against the safety. This is, it makes it look easy, but this is a good job. It's the most difficult thing for tackles to do is to close defenders in space. As it is, he bl doesn't block him perfectly, but he gets the job done. Touchdown, Miami. Really good job, everyone. So now we're going to look at the culture view, the box view of the film. Um, although I've waxed lyrical about the open field blocking of uh, Jackson and Flowers, really the true heroes of this play are our centre Carreras and our guard Davies. Just a reminder that we've seen in previous uh, breakdowns that the Bills are third down or gap control defence. So they're threatening... Uh, they're showing blitz here on our left hand side but as we the cadence goes through they actually show their hand and the linebacker walks down 44 is now threatening the right hand off at the center Carreras. really difficult block and again from film uh, the lineman will have seen that third down is is defensive line stunt day so let's use that against them so we pick up the blitz really well dip and rip from the linebacker trying to split the block we deal with it really well um, if I just take that back a fraction, we'll see that Carreras and uh, Davies actually get into a really nice combo block. Uh, so now expect it, both of the linebackers step, uh, sorry, the Carreras steps down, Davies steps to it, seal that block. My concern here would be looking at, at Carreras' body shape because his head's down, his shoulders are turned. But you know what, he pops up and not only does he pick the block up, but he actually runs the defender out of the hole can't speak highly enough for Davies block here you know he doesn't get much credit during the course of the season and fans seem unsure of him but this is a really top grade block not only does he step with the, now he's got the linebacker the linebacker is he's got leverage on the linebacker his shot head and shoulder across if, even if the defender was to get off that block it'd still be a, a positive run however let's talk of just watch the pancake we know it's a touchdown we know that jackson and flowers do a good job but let's just watch the pancake as the final play of this analysis there we go drive run your feet run your feet pancake good night uh touchdown Ackman. good job dolphins would like to see more of this in the course of the game <laughs>